Say hi to the camera, Kevin. <laughs> this is my nephew. You can show some emotion. Look at that. You're so serious. We're doing a boarding commissioner kind of look. From the show Gotham. Because you don't got that going on in the comics. Yeah, I know. So this is what I'm working with. This is the before. Very thick hair. Thick and curly. Wish me luck. To start this look off, I'm using a two and a half. I have the liver all the way down. Um, going a little bit above the occipital bone. Doing that all the way around. Going in different directions because you know hair grows in different directions and his hair is growing one way in one section, another way in another. It's, you know, you know the deal. half all around I went ahead and cleaned up all my edges to see where my lines were gonna be then I went back and went to about a two and a quarter to a two and then I went to a one and a half to a one to create a fade going down with one being my lowest maybe around the edges number and moving backwards I feel is the best method because you can really see the blend and all you're doing is taking away from the hair instead of kind of adding to it if you were to go one two or one one and a half to two two and a half oh my god i cannot believe my face looks this serious when i'm cutting hair ew look at my double chin oh my god never again am i filming something like that so now that I created the part where I want the line to be, originally he had it a little bit further down, which kind of grew in a little bit. I moved it up a little bit more because I realized that Commissioner Gordon has it a little bit above his eye, in either right eye or left eye or whatever. So I wanted to kind of mimic that in a sense. So now I'm using my trimmers, not a straight blade, just my trimmers, and I'm making a line, a nice small line to go across. After I completed the line, I took my thinning shears and thinned out the mop on top of his head because it was so thick and so fluffy that he needed to just use some of it to make this look come together. So as you see, I'm moving from the front, you're moving backwards, thinning out the areas needed. After thinning the area out, I went ahead with my regular shears and starting from the, the front to the back, I would pull straight up and then angle it to the right slightly. This way it gives it almost like a comb over look because if it was sticking too straight up and I cut it too short, it would um, totally kill the effect of the haircut. So I did that the whole entire way around to blend it as well. Still, because she's looking at my foot and tick. All right, well, this is the end result. The Commissioner Gordon look. My nephew loves it. I love how it came out. It's definitely different. Yep. And that is it.